Hello, welcome to Just Shoot Your Bow. The following match you're going to see is Marco Bruno from Italy versus Bodie Turner from the United States. It's a stressful match to watch, an impressive match to watch, an exciting match to watch, but definitely not boring. Um, what's even more impressive is that Marco Bruno only has five years of shooting experience. And his, uh, an impressive victory as a European champion in 2023 against a phenomenal shooter in Bodie Turner, who's won Vegas and Lancaster before. Um, it's one of those matches where you're like, there's no way they're shooting this many 12s. And they really do. But props to both Bodie Turner and Marco Bruno. It's exciting to watch, to see such high level archery amongst one very young man in Bodie Turner and another archer that's only been shooting for five years. Anyway, enjoy the rest of the video. And of course, all credit goes to Lancaster um, Archery Classic for the footage. I give them all the credit. Please subscribe to their YouTube channel. Please go to their website, buy their products. Um, I'm simply creating these commentary videos to spread more archery, to spread the love, to spread just awesome archery. I give credit where credit is due. Thank you, Lancaster Archery Classic, for making such an amazing um, show this year. And I hope to see more Lancaster Classics um, for a long, long time. Enjoy. So we're going to see how he adapts to the stage <laughs> and being in front of this crowd. Yeah, I'm going to tell him good luck because Bodhi just endured that mm -hmm. and thrived through that for another beyond perfect score. Yeah, 134. Uh, that's the highest we've yeah. seen. Oh. 133 was it. Now it's that's a 134. One. Also noteworthy, if Stefan had shot an 11, his last arrow, he would have been a 132, a technically perfect score. Um, <laughs> I don't want to hear that. Yeah, so. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I know what you're saying. Yeah, so Marco Bruno's going to have to come out and get in a quick rhythm because I think Bodie's already there. And I don't know. I, I think we're going to be more conservative on the 12 ring foot pedal here, but, mm -hmm. you know, we'll see. We'll see. Well, plus, I don't think Bodie's ever shot against Bruno, so you got to kind of feel out what type of shooter. Is he going to miss? Is he going to shoot a 10? Is he nervous? Yeah, there's, there's yeah, no real reason. There's one exactly. Right there, there's one so, right there. Yeah, you don't know what his, his tendencies are if he. You know, mm -hmm. how he reacts in big matches. So some guys, you're just going to wait him out. Some guys, like Stefan did with Bodie, you know you got to try to put it on him. So, yep. yeah, we'll see what goes. Called. Marco. Uh, he's not, he's not going to give up any room, but this match could effectively be over after this arrow. It's hard yep. to say. 12. Got, got it. it. Had to have it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And, and that is the risk reward here at the Lancaster Archery Classic. Here's PJ. We have three ends of this competition and then one final match to crown. <laughs> Hold on. Bodie just called it 12. I'm not sure what's happening. Yeah, Bodie just called it 12. <laughs> this is the best Lancaster Archery Classic that ever. there's ever been. Bodie called it 12. Ken Turner. Oh, got it. Oh, oh, he thought he dropped it out of the bottom, too. Marco not, not following yet. And he's, he's going to have to, but you don't have to do it right now. No, you don't, right? Stay in your rhythm. Yeah, I would do it. I would do it second arrow. I like, you know, get one mm -hmm. arrow in after that little bit of break between ends and then do it. And then uh, 11. your third arrow, you don't want to do it. You're the most weak in the end. So yeah, second right. arrow is the time to do it. He's not doing it. He's going to have to. 11. That one looks close. I'm yeah. not sure that's actually an 11, but we don't uh, officially call the score. So Marco's prepping for a 12 right here. He just punched the light. 11. Here we go. So he's going to try to unofficially tie the score. Got, Got it. it. All right, so for us, for you and I, I, I feel the same way you do about that top target. That's going to be a close call. Or it just could be the shadow. Yeah. No, no question about that one. But 
<laughs> That's, dude, this is wild. Thank you, Stefan Hansen, yeah, for he, creating this ruckus. Yeah, and he well, does. I'm, he's a he's an innovator. He is. He's he's definitely a thinker yeah. in archery. Is Hansen, but now Bodie Turner has already called to twelve. <sighs> Hold we, on to your hats, folks. Yeah. <laughs> this is wild. Twelve. Got it. <laughs> Best Lancaster archery classic ever. Eleven. It's gonna require four twelves in the future. Uh, I that's, think. What, that's what I'm saying. You're gonna have to shoot at four. Mm hmm Bodie can only shoot twelve once. He just the light it didn't get turned right. off. Yeah, it stays on so to the going for an eleven. Indicate that he didn't call it. Mm -hmm. I wish we had more matches. You know, we only have one more after this. <laughs> but I, you, I'm tired. Yeah, you drained. I'm tired. Eleven. They got nice. me tired. Yeah. Nice pickup, too, on that top target, though, for Bruno. Yeah. Getting right to the middle. So now Bruno's going to go 12 here. He just hit the button. Yep. 11. <laughs> has, Bodie, has Bodie missed a possible point yet? Yeah. He has I don't not. think so. He has, mm -mm. No, he did. Oh, last round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, right. no, he did. Yeah, he did last round. Yeah, he would be 102 if he was totally perfect, Whoa, so. got it. He didn't call the 12 in he the first call end. It, so he hasn't missed. Okay. Yep. And Bruno didn't Bruno miss got either. It. Wow, wow. 101, 101. 101, 101. That just sounds like a very odd number to call in the That's third end of a three yes. spot target Archery Archery classic. And how long has the 12 ring been in play? Is this the uh, third year? It's like third year. Second, yeah, yeah, third I don't or remember. It's been in play since today when Stefan came up, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. Because yeah. it's been used, but sparingly. Now it's a strategy. Mm -hmm. It's a method of attack. You can't play defense in this game. Stefan went all offense. He just changed the game. He's an innovator. Yep, 100%. And I'm tired. And he's getting credit for that. <laughs> You're a little tired. No, it's, I'm it's, just going to run with that. All right. Oh, Bodie calls 12. We're going <laughs> to... Of course, if, if Stephen goes to Vegas and hits an 8, you know, he'll he'll be like, I thought the 12 ring was down there. I, I oh, wait, the wait, has he, first end. has he called the 12 first end? Yeah, he, yeah. Okay, yep. here we go. He, first arrow, he's going for it. Final end to decide champion, and Bodie Turner decides to put it all on the line on this shot. Oh, that's close. Ooh. They're going to have to get real tight and call that one. It, it initially was marked eight by the spotter, um, but then it was changed to 12 off of the other spotter's 11. better angle. So we'll see what we get. Mark, Marco's in a tough situation here because he doesn't know what that is. Yeah. He may have to shoot at a 12 unnecessarily just in case. I would play it 11. as if it's a 12. It looks, it looks good. I'm looking at it again. I think it's good. Okay. Marco's guaranteed a podium, but... He just, 11. he's going to have to, that's, I mean, he, he hits it. So Marco Bruno has hit the 12. So after this shot, he's going for it. 11. Okay, these guys, the, Bodie 12. didn't miss a ring. Oh. He hit everything he aimed at. This is for the tie, 135 to 135 tie. Oh, my gosh. 12. Oh, he got oh. it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Dude, what is happening? I, I, We're watching a new new sport. And the thing is, I just want to bring this up. In end number one, Marco Bruno shot a 10. So he shot a 12 in end number one. Marco Bruno has hit four 12s <laughs> in four attempts back to back <laughs> to get a 135. Uh, I told you he could play. Uh, this this all changed. What is the probability, the statistical they, probability of being able to do that? They got it. They both and got it. And it's confirmed. You have the choice, first or second. You're shooting second. All right. 12 is called for both archers. <laughs> Come on, Bodie. Here we go. He's going for it straight away. Yep. No one's going to leave it the chance. Mm -mm. Golly. This is where I want to go second for sure. Ooh. They called oh, it in. I called they it called in. it in, but it's just biting Can if Bruno it's Can Bruno hit five twelves in a row? Is this possible? Well, he did oh, it. Oh, he did it. He didn't even have Leanne Rimes playing in the background this time. <laughs> Holy smokes, he did it. <laughs> five. Okay, we need an official call now on both. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 
yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Ooh, it's arrow yeah. at rest. It's arrow at rest. It's not the hole. Yep. All right, it's good. I, th I think it's it. I do. That yep. is a whisker. Whiskers he, count. Whisker counts. <laughs> <laughs> Even the person who finishes last in med school is called doctor. <laughs> Oh, dude, thanks, Stefan Hansen, for changing this up. That <sighs> kid has huge fortitude to do what he did. 12 called. Second scoring arrow. Tie score takes us to a closest to the center. And the 12 is not in play. Oh. Got a 12. Quarter shaft 12, easy. Yeah. Can Bruno hit six in a row? He got it. Oh, come now on. Now they go closest to center. All right. <laughs> and they're looking at each other, having some big smiles. Six in a row for Marco Bruno. Now, they're going to just double check it. Now we're going closest to center. It comes down to this. And this isn't even for the championship, ladies and gentlemen. This is just for a chance to go shoot against Mike Schlusser, the number one seed. Right. No, this is I the hope, guaranteed second. I hope second. these guys are ice cold because I would be tired after this Dude, match. <laughs> if you're Schlusser and you're, I, I hope you're watching this because yeah. he's got he's to come up with a new strategy. Golly. I hope, yeah, that's that's a tough one to step into. It's tough for these guys to keep this up, too. Yeah. Closest to the center. 11, inside out. Uh, okay. There's a little bit of room, but not much. A little bit. Yeah, you, you got to have totally inside out here on this one, basically. Nope, he didn't. Bodie advances. Wow. How do you like that match? To advance, to go shoot for this championship. That is the toughest third place finish I think I have ever seen in an archery tournament. The, the compound brought it, you know? Marco Herbo. Bruno, six 12s out of six 12s. <laughs> and, and lost. And lost. To third. And lost by two millimeters, three millimeters. Uh. But how about Bodie Turner? He brought it, he set the tone, and he was able to get it done as well. Hit up five 12s in a row for Bodie Turner.